doing a tag video and this tag video has been maybe around for three years yeah it's a pretty old one but like always I'm always late so the last time I ever saw this tag on YouTube was maybe five months ago by a youtuber that I personally feel like is really creative great quality she's beautiful and you know, you can tell she just puts in so much effort to her videos so if you check her out tell her I sent you her Username is HelloKatieXO and she is the best. You will not regret finding her or looking her up on YouTube, I promise. So the tag video's name is My Perfect Imperfections. If you're not too sure on what this video might be about, basically it, I'm just going to be talking about three things I like about myself, three things I don't like about myself. Basically the main reason I wanted to do this is because I love tags that will kind of give you guys an idea of who I am. I just really like them no matter what even if i'm viewing a youtuber like i love watching those types of tags so i hope you guys like this one sometimes you tend to look at someone and you're like that girl is just perfect she has nothing to worry about and as humans we tend to assume a lot so this is what this tag is for just to get, kind of inform you guys and um just kind of used as inspiration because that's what i felt when i saw hell well when i saw katie's um so yeah, um, without further ado, let's just get started. So I'm going to start off with three things I do not like about myself. So one of them is my forehead. It's right here, right here. I didn't really have a problem with it until I started growing up. Um, people did kind of mention it, and it was kind of in both a nice way and a bad way. Obviously, the bad way was always just, you know, blabbering. Like, I never had a direct bad comment said like to me it's either been on like twitter well the internet or it's just kind of been like that thing where someone opens their mouth and it just makes e their way to your ear so um yeah that's all i've heard it's always just been either like subtweeting or stuff like that so i kind of just started getting over the fact that i do have a pretty big forehead and as you can tell i don't like to hide it in any way i have thought about bangs but maybe just because of like winter coming up but other than that i don't think i really hide my forehead as much as people would expect me to that is one of my biggest advice for anybody of you who are kind of experiencing any type of bad comments towards like your appearance because people just tend to do that anything that doesn't tend to be perfect they tend to talk smack about it my biggest advice to that is just flaunt it flaunt your flaws so that's just going to kind of release some sort of confidence to those people and they'll kind of realize like okay this girl like it does not bug that girl so they'll try to like kind of get to you but at least you'll they'll know like you're comfortable with it as for me like i still don't like it i still not grown into it but i've gotten past it and i've tried to work with it so that's my biggest advice to anybody that's going with going through that type of you know bullying um, little stage or anything like that just flaunt your flaws the second thing i do not like about myself are my eyes I, oh well i guess overall i do like the shape of them the color of them i just don't like the size of them i think they're too small especially in pictures from like five feet away like my eyes disappear they just look really small and that was because i got i inherited that from my mom like i love my mommy's eyes but they're so small um, so that's something I kind of like struggle on like if I smile I guess that's the way I smile probably the fact that like my eyes just like kind of squint so I kind of like have to take a picture like this so the third thing I don't like is my bad temper and I think this kind of goes for everybody I'm obviously not at the point where I will slap someone in front of me just because I'm mad I just like don't like how I get so mad I guess I kind of resent some people and like that doesn't leave so that's something I really do not like about myself that I can't let go or get past that certain experience um I could but for certain people like I still bottle up these kind of resentment so um that's something I really don't like because I hate feeling 
sad or upset. Like, I like to be happy, if you guys can't tell. So now we're going to move on to the brighter side of the video. Three things I do like about myself. The first thing I do like about myself is my hair color. Actually, my hair color is black, or lately it's kind of been showing off as brown. I don't know, but I really like it. I don't really see myself with any other type of color. Uh, if anything, like, I'll try maybe like a caramel brown. Maybe just because I like caramel. So why not look like caramel? The second thing I do like kind of, I guess, falls into that. Well, not really. Anyway, I like the form of my eyebrows. Basically, uh, all I ever had to do was kind of just, like, um, clean them up a little because I inherited them from my dad. And my dad's is already, like, kind of, like, T -t -t -t. so is my mom's. Actually, I think it was, like, a mix of both worlds. <laughs> anyway, I like the shape of them. I think they frame my face nicely, so something I like. Lastly, the third thing I do like about myself is my personality. I feel like I'm that type of person who is really easy to get along with. I'm definitely shy at first, but I feel like after I get to know you, like, I'm just, like, really friendly. Like, I'll be like, let's go for lunch, you know? Um, so yeah, I think I'm probably that type of girl who doesn't know you, but she'll be like, hey, cute shoes. So yeah, I really like how easy I am to get along with, and just, you know, that opens up doors, so that's something I'm really proud of. My future looks so bright in each shade. Lame alert. So that was the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys are interested in more motivation talk videos like this one. This one was more like a tag, but let me know if you guys want kind of like an Ask Maria for Advice video. I think that would be really fun. I'd be like 100% so up for that um also let me know what kind of videos you guys have been waiting for me to do i have a lot of requests i'm sorry i haven't gotten to them it's just like everything's so overwhelming right now with college and it's like oh also make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet please do so uh if you are subscribed go ahead and please share my videos with the world or Anybody you think might like my videos, let's just leave them over here, please. At my 10,000 subscribers, I would really love to do, like, an amazing giveaway. So, if you guys like or are interested in that, just go ahead and help me out. Help a homegirl out, please. And that was the end of this video. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I will talk to you guys on my next video. Bye.